Shits and Giggles podcast, where we talk ish and giggle. I'm Keisha. I'm Kaya. And we have Simone, the producer, in the back. And together, we are Tits and Giggles Unedited. Warning, please be advised that this podcast is for entertainment purposes only and should not be considered as doctor advice. Please be advised that at some point you may need to adjust your volume due to screaming and loud laughter. All right, first question of the day. You and your sugar daddy, mm-hmm. sugar mama, have a falling out and y'all stop talking for a couple of weeks. Is this in the, is the, is the expectation still that they are responsible for your rent? Absolutely. What does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? You signed up for this. So, I mean, that could be considered as a break, but not, not to that, A break is that, okay, we can have a break, but the rent still due. The, uh, what is it? The, re- the not requirements, the responsibilities. The shade. No, they have not. They are still, it's the same thing. Falling so, out, whichever. You still need to pay. I'm, when I send you this bill, link. <laughs> I better get a screenshot of the confirmation that it is payment. So what? When do the, the stipulations change? When do you? When do they not have to pay? When we forever. When we, and that was gonna be my question. When, when we agree together that we are no longer doing this, then okay. Okay, so y'all had a little spat and you're, you separated for a couple of weeks. That don't count. That don't count. So it wasn't we agreed upon. Agree. I'm no longer going to take yeah. care. Oh, okay. We didn't agree. We need to come to a, a, an agreement. If we just, you know, stop talking for a few days and my phone bill get ready to come out, it better still be, you know, on the next day because you got to pay that. So what if y'all not talking when the bill is due? Does that matter? No. We, got, we have to agree, <laughs> like, together as to, did we agree that we're not doing this anymore? Did we agree... What? Just because you're not talking for a couple weeks, what? <laughs> you still gotta pay my bill. <laughs> I ain't got your face. Pay. Because we, she straight with it. She yeah, made I still expect it to be paid unless we agree that we're not, we're no longer together. Okay. What's your uh? Mine is no, because now I'm being spiteful, even though it's hurting me. I don't need you, so I'm gonna pay my own stuff. Wait, how we go to I don't need you? You don't even know what it was about. It don't matter. I told you I'm being spiteful. Y'all didn't agree on nothing. We agreed. I told you. Mm. No. Mm. That's crazy. So if y'all get back together, you're just supposed to be business as normal. So I actually go back to business as normal. Right. (laughs) Instead, I'm supposed to forget that you (laughs) spitefully didn't pay my bill when we get back together. Oh, my food is a business for myself. (laughs) You upset. Yeah. That's crazy. Uh-uh. Oh, so uh-uh. now I have pulled back on the tricks of the trade. Because who does that? Well, if you want the lights back on, you're going to bring the tricks back out. Wow. This is... Oh, my God. Um... I don't... I don't... I, I would hope that you would get... <laughs> oh, that you what? I don't know that I would ask for the money, but... <laughs> Closed mouth, don't get paid. That's why your lights gonna be off. <laughs> hey, I know we're in a bad place right now. <laughs> That's how you gonna leave. My bill is due in two days. Um, just remember. Damn. You gonna turn on auto auto pay? <laughs> I don't know that I would ask, but I wouldn't turn it away. Let's just say that. Hi, how are ya? You still upset? That's fine. My rent is still due. That's the hell I need. Yeah. You still doing that? Yeah. Oh, gosh. All right. That's a uh, second question. Some communities can live several family members to one house. So I've been playing around with the idea of moving in with somebody for, to save money for like three years. What y'all think about that? Like, we, you going to. You didn't tell me. You said what y'all say about it. Then you come right to me. No, I didn't say. I, I didn't want to cut you off. <laughs> I wasn't saying anything. Oh, okay, Justin. I'm thinking, geez. No worries. No worries. Um, <laughs> so, <laughs> wow. So in my mind, I'm like, if I were to take, if I were to take like three years, right? And then, <laughs> why are you looking at me like that? 
take like three years, you know, find somewhere that's manageable, obviously. Mm -hmm. Because if it's not, then what's the point? Mm -hmm. Um, And then save up as much as possible. And then at the end of the three years, you can either go your separate ways or um, continue the program. The arrangement, <clears throat> contract, or whatever you want to. <clears throat> Simone, would you like to speak on it? <clears throat> <laughs> well, um, <laughs> okay. So before we get into that, because you you was having a hard time, can we at least uh, agree that some people can get together, immediate family, extended family, whatever, and they have a goal. Oh, you're talking about family. Okay. Okay. I mean, it doesn't matter whoever you choose. Oh. Whoever you choose. But let's just for, just to, before we move on, y'all do agree that some people can get together, have a common goal, be successful, right? I do. You people, it's done all the time by other people. Okay. <laughs> Do you not know that that happens? Yes. <laughs> yes. Right. <laughs> my my chest fingers. <laughs> Come on. Yes, I agree. Okay, so go yeah. ahead. So now, um, say what you feel. You know, it's not what I feel. I think you feel. No, I want to hear what you, you know, have to say. Like I agree. You know, because that's what I did. But I moved back home. Okay. And I gave myself two years. And I feel like it's the best decision I've ever made. Because I'm not wasting money. I'm not put, well, I'm saying I'm wasting money, but yeah, I'm not wasting money. Because when I was by myself, I was putting on so much. It don't make no sense. If I could do it all over, my black mind would say, where the house? <laughs> So you think it's only for family? Like you want to do it for co-workers or a friend, best friend, Craigslist. Craigslist? <laughs> just, these, these, are, these are options. These are my options. <laughs> um, my best friend, yes. Um, yeah. Family, yes. Okay. just met you like a year ago I know you lying cause then oh I don't got the money for the rent uh uh-uh, uh I'm not going to I gotta know your financial habits a little bit before I just go ahead and move you in all willy nilly uh uh-uh. uh no mm-mm mm-mm alright so see family best friend that's it alright I think it can be done I mean as long as everybody's like minded and are gonna pay their bills because if the other person with you doesn't save, that's their business. Mm-hmm. You stick to your game plan, everybody have their set amount of bills, and work your thing, it'll be perfect. Uh-huh. Or it saves money, because right now everything's high as hell. Like, right. you can't get ahead, you barely survive. So that'd be a great way to, to get ahead, get a cushion, do other things. I, I'm not, I think it's a great idea if you stick, you stick to your part. It doesn't matter what the counterfeit is. So my thing is, I I like my space, and I don't know that I'm ready to be like every day. I just Come I want to say somebody. like see you, yeah, like see you all the time, and then I don't know like where your mind is because I'm not a I gotta talk to you every day type person. So if you feel like like being around somebody, you gotta engage with them, or now you got an attitude because I don't know, we're not, you know, we in the kitchen and you know everything's not chummy chummy. I just want to get my snacks and but that's a part of the expectations that can be set up ahead of time. You're, this is what this is. I mean, don't get it wrong. You can't tell people how to react. They, they're gonna act their way. Right. They know ahead of time. This is what this is. Right. And it is just, and sometimes to get to the goal that you want, you have to be uncomfortable. Mm-hmm. So, 
you you got to take you make that little sacrifice for a minute. Yeah. But your peace, the home is your peace. And if you're not at peace at home, yeah, that makes life a lot different. That's mm-hmm. one thing that be stopping me for a lot of stuff. I don't know that I'll be ready for the the sacrifice of stuff. Like mm-hmm. it's just not like this could help me, but I don't have like an ultimate goal to be like I want to get five thousand dollars or I want to put whatever down on the house. So like I don't really have something that's like pushing me to be like yeah, this is gonna live right. Well, you gotta figure that out first. Yep, that's what I was gonna say. Yeah, I said that and then work towards everything else. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I'm not doing that. So, yeah, sometimes I, you gotta get out of the way. I don't think you would, because you just <laughs> too. That's what I always laugh when I was thinking about. I'm like, hmm, he shouldn't. Somebody else in their house? Oh, no. That is not gonna work. She gonna take my house and be like, ah, no. This cup's still not in this thing from two days ago. Fair. True story though. I had I did have a conversation with somebody. Um, um the fact that and that's funny that you said Kaya talked about what they do is you know, that's on them. But that was actually a conversation <laughs> so it was kinda like, okay, we could set a goal and we put aside together or separate, like a certain amount of money. And then, you know, what you do is what you do. And like one of my questions was something about maintaining it or if something happened and they was like, well, if their car, say their car messed up, then we was like, we'll talk about it and see what, what will be a good move for me and for them to still maintain like the money that we put put it with. Um, yeah, I was just like, I'm small, but I, I need to like stress. situation that you just brought up should be easily handled because now you're saving money with uh someone helping you with bills so that should free up money to save and free up money for a little emergency cash thing for in case something like that your car tear up or whatever whatever Mm -hmm. because you should just say for instance i don't know what the setup would be but if you cut all your bills in half this now cuts your bills in half you have a lot of cash flow now because i don't know what Example, say example rent a thousand dollars that's just for five hundred dollars you just free up right. so you have the extra cash so in my mind it wouldn't be a problem but the thing is excuse me the thing is it would also depend on like how much money it makes this is true while everything could be cool when you know everything is perfect but then if something happened now that five hundred that you thought you had mm-hmm. now you only got two. 400 or 100 because mm. car payments be outrageous right now so yeah but it's still it's still more than what you had when you were doing it all by yourself because you wouldn't have shit if you were doing it all by yourself so yeah mm. it's I mean I guess it, it, it really depends on where you are in life and like I said what kind of goal it is <laughs> what kind of goal it. <laughs> But, still, but, going, but, but, but going back just, home was the best decision yeah, for you. It was definitely was. So you were, but was. you're doing it now. Yeah, because I gave myself two years. And I've been home for... If November hit and I'm still home, it would be three. November 22nd hit. And so I'm you already passed home. your two years that you gave yourself is what I hear? Yes. If November so you're 20, doing it now? Yes. <laughs> if November 22nd hit... But it's with family. Yeah. It I'm don't gonna, matter. And this, yeah. to her, it does because... If you're not her family or her best friend, she's not doing it. Hey, if she want to get to her goals hard enough, then do it. Yeah, that's why I went back home. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, third question. Do you want someone to protect you like Huck or Julius? Yeah. Huck is the guy from Scandal. Mm-hmm. You know, the... Um, You don't know any of the characters? How you know who I, Yo. You know who Julius is? Beyonce oh. security? Oh, no. Look, I'm very safe from everybody hates Chris. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, well. Just so that you, would you want someone to protect you? Is that what you're asking? You want to protect 
type. But it's a, it's a certain type of level. That's why I put them. Like, Huck would do anything for Olivia. Like, he would smash her head with his hand. <laughs> mm-hmm. Of course everybody would want that level of protection. I want somebody I know got me no matter what and yeah. will go to any means. And then Julius, of course, is just always there. Like, mm-hmm. I'm like, do you even go to sleep? Cause Not if she won't. <laughs> <laughs> That's an easy answer. No, I sleep when she right. sleep. <laughs> right. <laughs> That's just like when you have a baby. Actually, <laughs> no, because you gotta, you still gotta be protecting her while she sleep. Nah, he he right there. He got he sleep light. <laughs> he can hear people right. breathing heavy, yo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, um, I'm more of a. I think I'm, I'm more of a hot person because he just. I don't know. He just like that manly man. Not that Julius isn't, but he's like, I'm here, like. What? Mm-hmm. All right. Um, next question. What's something you only do? Oh, I'm sorry. Have you ever had a? Have you ever been a secret admirer? Yes. You been a <laughs> Michael B. Jordan? <laughs> I was gonna say Trace. I was gonna say Trace. I was excited. I wanted to be like, what you been doing? Yeah, for Michael B. What Me. does that mean? You. I look at his pictures. Instagram, you know, Facebook. That's saucer. Uh, <laughs> same difference. Take that out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about. <laughs> I'm talking about sending gifts. That's just like seventh grade when you wrote the note and put the little bracelet you made in it. Right. Yeah, not since like that. What? Oh, so let us in on what you secret admire. Yeah, because I know uh-huh. you got one. <laughs> you doing something. And don't. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's not it. I don't know if you know this, uh, <sighs> Simone, but I don't pay for stuff. So <laughs> that's not even possible. <laughs> <laughs> we went to the ice cream parlor the other day. Oh, oh, thank you. Uh-huh. Thank you. Uh-huh. Um. What's something you only do in a relationship? <laughs> Kaya? Man, I don't know. What do you mean you only do in a relationship? Like anything, anything. you want. I don't know. So you do the same stuff for everybody. Mm. Your side chick, your um, relationship, chick. your, mm-hmm. relationship. your uh, work husband, work wife, all of them get the same treatment. All of them special. You sound like Country Wayne right about it. <laughs> nah, I don't, I don't have all those things, but all of my people around me feel special. Don't you feel special? What? You are not a side chick. What? Brian, what are you done for me? You're crazy. What? <laughs> I'm here right now. Uh huh. Right now. I'm supposed to feel special? Yeah. Okay, Simone. <laughs> uh, um, what is this something that you only do in a relationship? Whatever they want. Wow. <laughs> well, that's a real answer. Yes, it is. What does that even mean? <laughs> whatever you want to do. Whatever. What? I'm not going to do the same thing I, that I would do for my boyfriend for some random. That's person. what I'm asking. Yeah. So what, what's the. Something in some specific. Yeah, what's the advantages of being your boyfriend versus a random? So I would buy, it's like, go walk in the store. And say, oh, I think you would like this shirt. I'll make the shirt up. I'm not doing that for a random person. Like, I'll go and get food, and I'm like, oh, let me see. Maybe he wants this. I'll call. He wants, and then yes, no, whatever. I'll just drop it off. Okay. I'll go out my way. But for a random person, <laughs> <laughs> but for a random person, no. I expect you to be calling me. <laughs> oh, gosh. <clears throat> oh, all right. Well, that's um, you didn't answer. Um, oh yeah, she said I don't pay for nothing. Nah, I forgot. Right. What? A, so how? Um, I don't know. I'm 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 more like Kaya. I think I treat everybody the same. Wow. Um, we just talk shit about you. <laughs> <everybody. laughs> all the people feel special. <laughs> 
You know what I'm saying? I see everybody sing. You know what I mean? Got y'all a little gift. You know what I mean? Same level. You know what I'm saying? It's a hard question to answer because it's, it's so specific to an individual relationship. So I don't know. I, yeah, I, I just I don't know. Mm, I don't know. I mean, I'm a I'm a nice person, so I try to do as much as possible with their reason. So I mean, besides like intimacy stuff, of course, you know. A lot of people are probably doing the same thing. So, yeah. All right. Uh, those are our questions for today. Let's talk a little bit about social media. So, have you guys heard about when Kelly was on uh, the t- Today Show? I think you told me. So, <clears throat> I'm paraphrasing, but <clears throat> supposedly Kelly went on the t- Today Show. As a guest for her movie, uh, what's it called? Mia, Mia, Mia Coppola. Coppola. Yes, that was good. You seen like it? it too. Mm-hmm. We both saw some. Oh, things. look at y'all! And so she did a guest host. I mean, I met, she did a guest appearance, and then they asked her to uh, host the show. So she agreed, and then when I don't know, it was the same day, the night before. But they gave her like a tiny dressing room. But they gave Jennifer Lopez, who I'm assuming was a guest, a bigger dressing room. So because they couldn't accommodate Kelly with her guest host uh, accommodations, she left. Hmm. Um, so what are y'all's thoughts on that? Like if you if you came to as a guest and then they said, oh, can you host this party? And you was like, cool. But then they couldn't accommodate your needs. Would you be like, yeah, no, I know I said that I would do it, but unfortunately, because you can't accommodate me, and I'm kind of doing you a favor. You gotta show me that you appreciate me. Right. So. Because I guess I'm don't, she she doesn't need it. And I'll I'll go with you. You're not gonna disrespect me and give somebody to say yes stuff than you give the one that you're asking to host this stuff. Right. So you gotta show me the same, more respect than what you're showing her, because you mm-hmm. you just said, piss on Kelly. So right. I, I, would, I would rock you. Roll away just like she did. What you think, Simone? I agree. I have to go with Ron here, because I'm doing you a favor. He originally asked me to be a guest, and now you're asking me to host this, so you're gonna give me a closet? <laughs> no, ma'am. <laughs> or sir. <laughs> You're not doing it in the closet, yeah. No. Ooh, no. Not that. You know, getting dressed and prepared for the show. No, that's right. crazy. The host? You won't know. Right. Mm-hmm. Maybe when so I bet you the other co host had huge stuff and were well accommodated mm-hmm. and you didn't get when you give the guest speaker for the day a bigger joint. Mm-hmm. Yeah, now you're not gonna disrespect me. Right. Now. And then Bethany Frank was gonna make a whole video talking about Basically saying she should be grateful and everything there is small. Crazy. That is desperate. That's a desperate child. Listen, you don't need to do nothing. For, what? You don't need to be there. Like, and like I said, I'm basically I'm doing you a favor. Like you asked me to fill in, and obviously this is short notice. Yeah, yeah. Like you asked me to be a guest. You ain't gonna be yeah. a hosted. And you gonna give me a closet? No, ma'am. Take this closet <laughs> and this mic off me right now. Right now. Mm-hmm. Right now. All right. Um, next topic from social me- social media. Girl loses boyfriend over on stage dance. So there was a couple that went to a concert. And the artist has like a silhouette dance. He calls the girls up on stage. I, I saw that. <laughs> I saw she was wild <laughs> for that. I so, yeah. They go behind the curtain, and you know there's a spotlight, and then they start dancing. Like she so it's just right behind, behind the curtain dancing with the with the artist. With the oh, artist. With the artist. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So he's basically standing there doing the things guys do, and she's moving herself around. She's she's wilding, facing him, going down as if she is doing fellatio. She um 
turn around. He aggressively puts her <laughs> head down. It's a lot. It, it was it was crazy. And then the whole time, the people in the audience they are videoing the boyfriend. And at first he's like, eh, and then he starts to look concerned in the face. Mm-hmm. And then afterwards, they show him walking by himself. And I think she's like talking to her friends and saying, am I wrong? Am I wrong? Long story short, it appeared as though they had broke up like days after social media because he had appeared on like another platform and they was acting like they was trying to fix him up with another girl. Mm-hmm. And then the girlfriend came out with a video trying to like explain herself. And she explain. said they had a conversation prior to her going on stage. Like, he knew she wanted to go on stage. Mm-hmm. But that don't mean you an embarrassed man, like, in front of everybody. Regardless if it's backstage, we can see you. Like, the light is shining. We see what you're doing. Mm-hmm. So. So everyone was fully dressed. There was no actual fellatio or none of that. No. So the question is, would you be bothered if your mate engaged in a sexual dance on stage? Nah, no. No, but you gotta see it. It's just, it's just <laughs> man, that girl was wild. No, she was having a good time. Too much of a good time mm-hmm. because ain't no way. You don't think that's girl. embarrassing? That is very embarrassing. Everything in life is embarrassing if you look at it that way. Get and it, so get if it. a girl, somebody's on stage and they are the person. Let's say you got the artist is standing up, and then your girl. Say your girl got her hands on the person's thighs. And Everybody's her face. fully dressed, right? Yeah. There's no dick in the mouth. <laughs> Look, there's no dick in the mouth, right? Hold on. Let it's me, it's not. You, I don't think you're going. You're going to change. Change my opinion. Look at this girl. You not Look gonna be concerned when y'all go home. That's the boyfriend. When I go home. Look at the boyfriend. When I go home, I know she primed and ready for me. Oh my God! Eh? Absolutely not. <laughs> yeah, right. Look, 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 look. Thank God that goes on. No, no. This is, no. This is oh absolutely not. I'm not. I'm so, not so like, Okay, so what if I'm you? I'm not embarrassed what if you, when I learn those things. What, what you gonna be like? Yeah. Get it, baby. Work it. Work it. Yeah, okay. Work it. I yeah, promise okay. you. I don't, cause it's, it, she's having a good time. She's not okay. actually having sex. Okay, and it's it's all make believe. Like she's having a ball. Okay. I'm cool with that. One hundred percent. So is this cool only it. for a concert? Well, where else are they doing it? I mean, cause by your logic, I'm thinking if you say your girl's at home, at home, somebody who she said is her friend come over, and, and I'm there too. You there too? Okay, I'm there too. <clears throat> and the friend starts grinding. So, so they're dancing. They like they just randomly grind. Cause we gotta, we gotta, we gotta get the whole scene so I can get a full. I mean, by your logic, it don't matter because they got their clothes on. They do have their clothes on. And for whatever reason, they start grinding on each other. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You cool? No, not in that situation. Why not? Because that everybody know that this is the whole stage dance that he does it at every concert apparently. She was already hyped to try to get on stage. This was already pre-talked about. Like every the stage was completely set for that. Now, dude, your friend coming over and y'all randomly just grinding. Okay, the first time, cool. Second time, wait a minute. But you just said they got their clothes on. Like they do. They said a concert. Like I think they're making a big deal out of nothing with the concert thing. They'll they'll probably never ever see that celebrity again. They were just having a good time. She was just having a good time. Damn, that seems so that that it was uncalled for. I think it was uncalled for. And that's cool for you to think it's uncalled for. Cause I'm thinking, even if even if I'm like, okay, this is a concert, something could come out of it, something might not. And my person is in the audience. Even if we had a conversation. You can't not think about the perception from everybody else there. But see, that's the problem. That's why most people are unhappy because y'all are too busy worried about what other people perceive. Mm. That is too much. What do you think, Simone? Absolutely not. Well, you, you knew her was absolutely not. You knew both of y'all was absolutely not before you even asked the question. No, I don't. I, I need to. 
I want to see mm-hmm. what she said. Why do you think that it wasn't appropriate? Because what 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 type of time you was on? <laughs> Having what? fun. No. 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 <laughs> Absolutely. So no. that was too much. So so. Don't even do it. Yes, I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm doing it. So Trey Song That's before different. you on the stage. Oh, That's different. different. Trey That's Song before you on the stage. That's different. And you get the, y'all get to portray this act that they did. So you just gonna sit there and go like this? You're not gonna do nothing? You're not? Well, she gonna be trying to take his clothes off. You understand me? Because <laughs> what? <laughs> so. That's different. It's not different. No. Because How do you know going she- into any relationship, they know. That if some, for some she random reason, like <laughs> oh, of course. if Trey Songz <laughs> or Michael B. Jordan walk by, it was not I'm it. risking it all, okay? You risk it yeah. all. It's not even for what? Risk. She just He's not even going to talk to you after I love you're them. done. I love them. And I need them to earn me too. So no. you would risk somebody who is literally, after he's done. I would go right on that, that's like the stage like a girl. Yeah, I'm risking it all. If they call me up there, yes. I'm risking it all. I'm doing just what that girl said. <laughs> to what? To be now sad and alone? That's fine. At least I got the chance. <laughs> Wait, not the beat. What are you talking about? You say you won't risk it all. Yeah. I'm going to mean it. I'm doing what that girl did. So if she want to leave, that's fine. <laughs> and that's what I'm saying. Your, uh, but so, at least I have my memory. I had the memories hold you at night. What? Are you serious right now? Holy shit. <laughs> At least I have a memory a of a memory good time. Yes, of a good time. He need a man up. Don't we need go, but hold on, hold on. So the girl was wrong just a second ago. If the situation was turned and it was him up on there with Nicki Minaj, whoever, would you be okay with that? Would you like? Would you be cool with that if the situation was turned? Nah, fam. Have have your have your fun. To, but be respectful. Because mm. for me and mine, ah! in my mind, <laughs> it's going to be a problem. It, you're not you going to get the opportunity again. I, to put your face in somebody's pants. pants? A celebrity. Yes. No, absolutely not. He's a celebrity. As, I don't give a ra- They bleed just like I do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't give a rat. But... <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> you will not embarrass me. <laughs> and where you putting that face at when we get home? So in the shower. Everything. Right. Yeah. Hello, darling. No. It's pants. It's, pants. it's pants. It's not like it was actual body touching. And, uh, yeah. Well, the next person you come in contact, put your face on their pants. Yeah. 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 Yeah
with the fitted. I can guarantee you they're not. <laughs> I, I can guarantee you they're not. Unless that tarp come out. No. <laughs> hey. 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 <laughs> what hey. You ain't gonna know the difference. I'm you gonna be thinking you extra uh today. They gonna be like. I told you they have them prime and ready for me. Easy work. You have to be more careful. Yeah, man. You have to be more careful. Well, tell me once you get that tarp light. Let me mm-hmm. tell you how it changes. Let me show you how it changes. Mm-hmm. All right. Mm. <laughs> anyway, uh, what y'all doing? Slide in the living room. No. <laughs> slide in the living room. Slide in the living room. Right if y'all if you're not. So. Oh, what you say? You're not doing something right if you can't slip and slide. In the living room is crazy. Living room, kitchen, bathroom. Kitchen? We don't, <laughs> where you we, don't, we, don't, we don't discriminate where you sleep. Oh, and Lord, have mercy. She said she's Beyonce. Yeah. <laughs> Waking up in the kitchen, don't know what happened. Mm-mm. Goodness. <laughs> No, because we 
when you do that, you, you get, get water, water right here. here. Yeah. Uh, uh, I go like this. So, so she go like this. I no. I don't, yes. like, I don't like that. Yes. <laughs> I, don't like, <laughs> I don't like it. Yes. I don't like you, it one bit. That is no. No, you man. ain't getting enough with that. Uh-uh. I go like this, and then I take the spoon oh, and... Jesus. <laughs> Chicken, potato salad, and cabbage. What um chicken tenders? It was raw chicken, and then you made it into chicken tenders. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Chicken tenderloins. Gotcha. I made some um, buffalo chicken a couple days ago, and I used mozzarella cheese instead of regular regular shredded. Mm-hmm. Cause I thought I had shredded cheese here. And then I had that vegan cheese, but I had used that on some macaroni. Um, but I didn't, I didn't, I don't think I taste 
Positive, positive, positive thoughts. And we're out.